What's up guys, Ryzen34 back with another epic opening and in this one we're going to be opening 24 packs of Metal Raiders, a booster box of legacy packs. These are the 2017 edition, but the reprints of the original 2002 set. So this is going to be a lot of fun and that's not the only thing we're announcing. We're also going to be doing Legacy Week, that's what I'm going to call it. It is starting on Tuesday rather than a Monday, plus I wanted to start it on Monday, but the package didn't arrive so, with all the stuff in it. So, Tuesday. Legacy week. We're going to be opening five different sets. Legacy packs. We're opening Metal Raiders, Spell Ruler, Pharaoh Servant, Dark Crisis, and Invasion of Chaos. All this week, 24 packs of each, five days in a row. The only way I will change that up from five days in a row is if we hit 20,000. Then I'll throw the 20k special in there, and then we'll continue the five days. So that would not be upsetting because that video is going to be insane. First edition LOB, Retro Pack 1, Retro Pack 2, Champion Pack 1, that kind of stuff. So make sure you guys hit the subscribe button for that. But either way, Legacy Week this week, it's going to be insane. Hope you guys enjoy it. Make sure you check out my TCG Player and eBay affiliate links below if you want to support the channel. All you have to do is click those links below and then buy whatever you want. It supports me. I appreciate it. And the giveaway for you guys, Catapult Turtle, I don't know what I'm talking about. That's from Metal Raiders. We're giving away some Metal Raiders hollows. These are not 2017 reprints. These are the originals. Catapult Turtle, Seven Tools of the Band and Ultra Rare, and the Epic Horn of Heaven, guys. Yes. Ultra Rare. All of these are original MRD not 2017 so these are a little bit more valuable pretty cool all you have to do is like the video be subscribed let me know your favorite card from metal raiders or the card you want to see me pull and let's get into this opening we have never done a 24 pack booster box of metal raiders before i've never even opened a booster box of metal raiders so this is i'm actually really looking forward to this one i hope we pull gate guardian i hope we pull uh, thousand dragon would be cool as well because in the 2017 legacy packs you can pull both secrets then, of course, Summon Skull. So any of those will be awesome. Those are our goals for this. Now that we've gotten through all that, let's see what we can pull. Kojikazi, Princess of Shirugi. Kaminari Attack. That's pretty decent. In first edition, that was actually worth something. Okay, next pack. Yeah, there's so many guys. The Ultras in this set are amazing. They're super good. There's so many good ones. Solemn Judgment would be another really cool one. Legahole. 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 I've always said Leogol, but it doesn't make sense. There's Leo Gun. Feral Imp, that's such a classic card that that waited till uh, Metal Raiders. We have White Magical Hat. You guys watch Progression Series, you've seen some serious work from that card. So that's, and just all these old cards are pretty epic. Okay, here we go. Next pack, we've opened two packs of Metal Raiders. I'm probably going to be um, doing one of those things called a premiere for all of these. So we're going to be chatting it up live. It's going to be fun. Labyrinth Tank, I'm hoping we can pull something good. Soggy, the Dark Clown. Classic. There it is. We're giving one away. And we pulled one Catapult Turtle Super Rare. Our first foil from Metal Raiders. There we go. That's pretty awesome. Catapult Turtle. I've had some pretty good pulls from Metal Raiders. But I've never pulled the, the Gate Guardian on camera. I've pulled it twice before I did YouTube. Mini, or I did some YouTube, maybe, but, but not really card videos. So it would be pretty cool to pull a Gate Guardian. That would be pretty crazy. Sword of Deep Seated, Rock Over Grotto, Legal, and Mass Sorcerer. Bottom Dweller, there's another Kaminari attack. The interesting thing about these 2017 packs, guys, I forgot to mention. We're searching for the Pecanio Moth. We could pull multiple Pecanio Moths in this video. Can you guys imagine that? This set, it, it, it could be an insane video if we pull a couple of those. But also, what I was saying, 2017 packs. You can pull the short prints just as regular comments. They don't, they're not short printed, so it's a lot easier to get that stuff. Lava Battle Guard. Magician of Fate. There's a nice rare. It's a good one. Hibikime, bottom dweller. Pump King, the King of Ghosts, and Ancient Elf. Okay, I said that about short prints. We haven't seen a single Pequeno Moth, so there's definitely something fishy going on here, guys. No Pequeno Moth. Somebody scaled them for the Pequeno Moth, didn't they? Germ Infection. Water Amotics. This is the um, alternate art, that's for sure. Not alternate, but. Um, English, what do they call that? I can't remember. <laughs> Edited, I don't know what the word is. Robin Goblin, Disc Magician, Paralyzing Potion, Unhappy Maiden. Okay. So far only one foil, so we're hoping that the uh, the fire will appear soon. Maybe we can pull something good. Here we go. Crash Clown, Crass Clown, not the Class Clown, Killer Needle, Sword of Deep Seated, Rock Ogre Grotto number one. We got a Dark Elf Rear, Pale Beast, Rabbit Horseman. Guys, losing his faceless mage. No hollows and no Bacanio moss. What is this? Fishy? Okay, we have a hollow. We have one hollow. I say fishy. I don't know about you guys. No Bacanio moss? I mean, that's crazy. 
Killer Needle, here we go. Let's pull something good, sort of deep seated. There's another Rock Ogre Grotto number one. And a Twin Headed Thunder Dragon, that's a super rare. This looks dark. Interesting. Yeah, these 2017 foils look a lot different from the originals. I do have a video about how you can tell the difference between 2017 and um, the old ones. And it's I'll put it up in the eye to my Yu-Gi-Oh! Discussions playlist. That is one of my most used playlists that I would refer people to. It, they're old videos, but for the most part, they're still super relevant and helpful. Like stuff like how to grade your cards at PSA and stuff like that. So I share those videos all the time. So if you guys ever need info like that, that's the playlist to go to. I think it has about 10 videos. Okay, Lava Battle Guard. Armored Zombie. We've got two foils. Let's get an Ultra Rare. Tremendous Fire. Kojo Kazi. We got a Star Boy. King of Yami Makai, the classic weird defense. Thunder Dragon, that's a nice one. I have been using Thunder Dragons in one of my GOAT decks, so it's working out pretty good. So we've got Thunder Dragon and Twin Headed Thunder Dragon. So I can throw those. I actually didn't have many copies of Thunder Dragon set aside in my GOAT. Um, box, it's not even, I, okay, I said goat deck before and people are always like, like, how do you put that many cards in your goat deck? Like, you say it all the time. I have a box that's like anything that can be played in goat, I'll put it in there. So, if there's a, a card like Thunder Dragon, I might have like forgotten to put it aside or like not realized people used it, you know, when I first started that box. So I didn't have many copies of that with Princess of Surugi again. Another Thunder Dragon, nice. Jirai Gumo and Cheerful Coffin. So I wasn't setting them aside. So now I'm going to start doing it and I'll give myself some extras. I fortunately have like three total. I had just enough. Okay, soul release. Let's get a foil, guys. Let's get an ultra or a secret. Trent. That's still a weird name for a tree. Block attack. Shield and sword. Uses shield and sword on... Uh, what is the card that Joe uses shield and sword and then attacks with? It's a... Uh, bat battle. Yeah. <laughs> and he attacks the zombies. Because they have zero defense. His Battle Warrior goes to a 1,000 attack, I think. The Bistro Butcher. Soul Release. Okay, so far, just two foils. Let's see if we can get Mushroom Man number two. Trent, which is Apprentice. Okay. Uguchi. <laughs> Launcher Spider and Cocoon of Evolution. So far, we're one half through. Nothing too crazy. But we're hoping that we can pull something big. Here we go. Harpy Lady. Nice. Guilty of the D-Knight. This guy is pretty awesome. I always thought he was cool. Musician's King. Crass Clown. Fake Trap. Swan Battle Guard. This Magician. Okay, come on. Where are the big boys? Well, we need to end strong. Kind of like our Invasion of Chaos 24 packs. We pulled those double demox. Check that out. Share the pain. Whoops. We got a Fair Limp. A big eye. Can we pull something good here? Soggy the Dark Clown. I mean, hard to argue that Soggy is not a good card. Guys, okay, wait a second. We have not pulled a Pecanio Moth. What's going on here? This is weird. This is really weird. Okay. Um, there are like 143 cards in Metal Raiders or something. It's like one of the most, I think. Oh, Baby Dragon. I haven't pulled that either. So, it's pretty tough to pull at Bistro Butcher. Thousand Dragons! Secret Rare! That one kind of snuck on, up on me. We're talking about Bacanio Moth. That's pretty epic. Thousand Dragons Secret Rare. We were looking for Gate Guardian. Got Thousand Dragon. I will take that. I don't know if I've ever even pulled this card. So that's really cool. I mean, that looks really nice. Check out that. The foily name looks really nice. Ooh, Thousand Dragon. There's a big pull, finally. We got a Sangan. That's nice. Still, okay, Lady De Fe, but no Canyon Moth. Lady De Fe is praying, so maybe she'll pray. That'll help us get the Canyon Moth. Please. Here we go. Sort of deep seated. Baby Dragon. Labyrinth Tank. Oh my goodness! Back to back secret rare pulls! What? Gate Guardian! I just said we're looking for Gate Guardian, but we got the other one. Back to back secret rare pulls. Gate Guardian. Oh my goodness. These legacy packs, they just seem to always provide us something. Wow, talk about back-to-back -back packs. And last time it was it was back-to-back Demock. -back now it's back-to-back -back secret rares. Wow. Wow. Those are some nice pulls, guys. Oh my goodness. Gate Guardian. One of that's a fan favorite right there. I know a lot of you guys like Gate Guardian. There's a magical hat. We got a pump king, the king of ghosts. Wow. That is that's cool. That's the third one I've ever pulled. So I got a play set that I pulled. 
I don't have either of the other two anymore, so we're going to have to keep this one. Wow, so no ultras, two secrets, two supers. Okay, now we're going for Summon Skull, I guess, because we got both secrets. Harpy Lady, Musician King, Killer Needle, and a Mooka Mooka, Insect Soldier of the Sky, Niwatori, and the Cheerful Coffin. Okay, that's pretty good, guys. That's pretty good. That is pretty good right there. All right, we got Water Emotics. I don't even know. That's great. Like, am I supposed to be expecting this craziness now? Because it happens every time. Miles Radiant. I don't know, but I'm not complaining. There's a Flame Cerberus. That's cool. We still have a few packs left, too. Like, if we pull, like, Summon Skull, guys, or if we pull a third secret, <laughs> like, that'd be, that'd be absolutely nuts. Okay. Here we go. Armored Zombie. Can we get something epic? I mean, we've already gotten something epic. I mean, something else epic, I guess. Kojikazi. Seven Colored Fish, which is a print. Pale Beast. Guys, if we don't if we don't pull a Pequeno Moth, I'm going to... Like, I don't even know what I'm going to do. That's insane. 24 packs? We pulled two more secrets than we have Pequeno Moths. <laughs> okay, Electric Lizard. Dream Clown. Come on, Pequeno Moth. That's what we need now. That's all that matters. Dream Clown. Blackland Fire Dragon. Harpy Lady Sisters. Sweet. That's a sweet super rare. All right. Harpy Lady Sisters. That's really cool. I will take that. Okay. Can we get the Pequeno Moth, guys? Rabbit Horseman. Tongyo and Morphe. No Pequeno Moth. We only have four more packs to pull it. Unreal. Okay. Come on. Show yourself. Tain your wisdom. Yeah! We pulled it! Pequeno Moth! We gotta sleeve that bad boy up. English version, so that's pretty crazy. I mean, it's not the Pequeno, it's the Petite Moth, but pretty crazy. Let's set that in the background. Yeah, that needs to be back there. Okay, Mask of Dark. I forgot about even cared about the foil. Lady DeFay, because we have the epic Pequeno Moth. Unbelievable. We finally pulled it. We pulled a Gate Guardian before we, before we pulled a Pequeno Moth, so that, just let that sink in. All right. Blue Winged Crown. Kojikazi. Back to back. Unbelievable. Hoshingen. Back to back. There's a Larva Moth in there as well. The traitorous brother. Wow. Wow. Talk about epic. If we pull a play set in the last four packs, guys, I might lose it. I might literally lose it. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Legal. Baby Dragon. Guilty of the D Knight. Steel Scorpion. Great Moth. Then we finally pulled the, the Grande Moth. Illusionist Faceless Mage. Alright, final pack. So far we pulled pretty insane. We pulled double Pequeno Moth. We pulled both Secret Rares. And we pulled three Supers. No Ultras though, which is pretty weird. So this set says great Ultras. It'd be nice to pull one. Let's see if we can do it. Lava Battle Guard. Dream Clown. Guardian of the Labyrinth. And Castle of Dark Illusions. Alright, so no Ultra Rares out of 24 packs. There's a Thunder Dragon tonight. So that's a little weird, but uh, overall, I can't complain with what we pulled. So let's see what we did get. Let me pull these out. Alright, we pulled a play set of Thunder Dragon. That's pretty nice. Nice GOAT format stuff. Here we go. Magician of Faith. That's sweet. Double Sangan. Also sweet. Whoops, we gotta be careful. Almost bent that. That's not good. Alright, Harpy Lady Sister. Super rare. We got a Catapult Turtle Super Rare, which we're also giving away, so make sure you guys leave your comment down below about what your favorite card was, yada, 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 if you want a chance to win it. Twin Edit Thunder Dragon, that's pretty epic, and then, oh, we're getting into the craziness, Thousand Dragon Secret Rare, that was awesome, Gate Guardian Secret Rare, that was awesome, awesome, that was so cool, I can't believe you pulled that. Check out all those, check them out, we got... Okay, what are they? Kazijin, Suijin, and Sangha of the Thunder mixed together in there. That's pretty sweet. And of course, the most epic pulls of all, Double Pequeno Moth. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you guys like the video. Subscribe for that 20,000 subscriber opening. Share the video to help me out. We're doing five Legacy openings in a row, guys. Legacy Week. Hashtag Legacy Week on Twitter. Yeah, it's not a thing, but you can start it if you want. And then we've got Instagram. You know, Go follow me over there as well as Twitter. Of course, so Legacy Week is going to be a lot of fun. We started off hot with double secret rares. Thank you guys for coming to the premiere. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Oh! Yes. Okay, you. Oh. Elemental Hero, Dark Bright. Boom! Oh.